We begin with that story, and it is the story of Mayan Burrell. In 2002 is when it started. A man who had served at that time 18 years in prison after being convicted of the murder of 11-year-old Taisha Edwards. The family of an 11-year-old girl killed by a stray bullet is turning their devastation into outrage tonight, demanding answers. That day, when I when I went up to uh, Portland Fools, it was it was early in the day, and um, and I just I sensed something off, like it was just something didn't feel right. I remember just looking outside and seeing like unmarked squad cars. I haven't done anything wrong, so I didn't have any fear. Three people are arrested, including Mayan Burrell, who was 16 years old at the time. Long story short, I ended up getting kidnapped. Um, and that was the last place I seen a free world for nearly two decades. But what happened between the arrest and the announcement of the charges became a topic of an AP and American public media investigation. At least two of those witnesses have come forward to say that, that they lied at Mayan's trial. As a community, we have consistently called into question Amy Klobuchar's record as a prosecutor and her tough on crime approach that played a role in Mayan Burrell being incarcerated along with numerous other young African-American men during that time period. My entire youth was spent in the, in the justice system, in the criminal justice system. That system was designed to dehumanize people and to turn them into something um, other than a human being. Being t taken out of the unmarked squad car, put into a police squad car, and hauled into Hennepin County Jail as a 16-year-old child. I remember the devastation and just feeling like lost. And, and then for like uh, the way that they were talking to me, it was like I was actually like uh, public enemy number one or something. Talk about injustice. Like if you want to talk about the criminal justice system, like you could go and look at the facts of my situation. Look, look at the facts of my case. Look at all the police misconduct. Look at all the lies. Look at look at look at all the falsifying evidence. Look at all the like look at all of these things, and then go back and research and see if any if even one of these people were were held accountable for for the for the injustice that they imposed on me.